some people may be wondering on how to pray and when you pray you are having a conversation with God that's it so the same way that you would speak to me the same way that you can speak to God of course don't say anything disrespectful of course that should go without saying really <laughs> so when you pray what I do I repent before I pray because I want to make sure that God will consider my prayers and we know that God does not consider the prayers of sinners unless they repent first does that make any sense so even if you believe that you did everything correct, even if you've been serving God for 1,000 years, still repent before you pray because you never know you may have done or said something that was wrong. Okay. So this is an example prayer, or you can use this prayer as well. You can say this every night, and some people may say, well, I don't want to say the same things or should I say the same things every night when I pray? Of course. God does not care if you say the same things to him every day. He is not human. Maybe if you come to me and say the same things to me every day, I will be like, hey, <laughs> come on now you know but God is not the same way he does not mind if you pray about the same things every single day actually what he really cares about is you speaking to him so you can't lose okay example prayer God please forgive me for everything for anything that I have committed so first you repent that is repentance okay here goes the prayer God thank you for everything that you have done for me thank you for everything that you will do for me help me become a better obedient servant to you take away everything that is keeping me away from you protect me while I am asleep and awake protect my family friends and associates if they are not obedient to you intervene more in their life constantly give them thoughts of you let them feel ashamed for not serving you give them give them the desire to pray and read the Bible get them to repent every day in in the Bible it says that you can make hearts hard since that is so soften the heart of people make them more compassionate and understanding protect me while I am driving or walking protect me from any type of accidents or danger <clears throat> strengthen my guardian angel angels Heal them from their injuries. Cheer up and encourage them as well. Protect my family, friends from any danger. Warn them of any danger that may come their way. Place a hedge of protection all around us. Protect us from any demonic attacks that demons may have planned. Protect all the Christians all around the world especially where Christianity is suppressed. And those countries give those Christians a way of escape. Okay. Let them escape the countries where they are being persecuted. Find them a safe haven or safe havens. Make sure they have plenty food and water to drink let all their needs be met i bind and cast out any demon or worker of darkness 
that tries to come against my family, friends, and associates. Strip away all power from anyone that is in the occult, especially the people who are coming against me and the people that I know. Give healing to all of us. Complete healing. Touch all of our minds. Give us better understanding. Give us more revelations. Let us know more of you. Let us not be in ignorance. So this is just an example prayer here. And you can add to it. You can do your own style, whatever. So you can use this. So this is how you pray. Okay, God bless.